Good afternoon, everybody. This is Castarian Kid talking to you. Have you ever had that question of what do you do with a kitchen when you go camping? Well, when I get the permission slip from the missus, I just grab my, my campmate's kitchen and throw in the back of the truck, and I'm halfway there, not searching through tubs or trying to find dishes that are dirty. This is a self-contained unit that is outstanding. If you ever get a chance to find one of these on eBay, I strongly urge you to pick one up. I'm just going to go through really quickly, show you what it's all about. It's a camp mate. The lid comes off, and basically what they're recommending is that you use one of these for a, a sink, but it's too big for me, so I just set it aside. It's great to put protection from the animals. I carry a, a vinyl bucket, and I use this for just rinsing off dishes or having some water near the campsite. The other thing I always make sure is I carry a, a tablecloth to put over it, nice and clean. This way I don't have to worry about all the bugs and stuff like this when I get to the camp. And then I carry a paper towel holder. And this is uh, made by Montane, M-O-N-T-A-N-E. What's neat about this is that it leaves the paper towels nice and dry, especially if you have a dew or you got a little humidity in the air. I usually hang these from a tree nearby. That way they're always out of, out of the way, but I'm also uh, having them available to me when I need them. I always make sure I have a stove. The stove I have, I'm showing you right now, is a Coleman dual fuel stove. And what I typically do is I'll bring my rack here, my stove rack, and I'll place the Coleman stove on top of that. That way it gives me some extra space up on top here. I typically put this at the end of the picnic table and I make my dinners or my meals that way too. So I'm gonna set this aside so I can show you in a couple of minutes how this all works together. What's really interesting about this is it has bat wings on it. It comes across, comes open like this, and these little doors here, if you can see it, they fold up and then they lock into place here so they don't move a lot. And that's really ingenious. Now I have a big working surface. I can make meals. I can set things aside. I can put spoons in there, everything where, where else I need them. On the side, we have different things. We have more pan spray, dish soap, a lantern, some different spices I have here. On this side, I have different spices. I have some celery salt, some Cajun seasoning, some oil, some um, dish soap, some olive oil, soy sauce. I got these little containers from REI, label them myself. Hand soap, toothpicks, I always need toothpicks, and some wash and dry so I can sanitize things. So that's the beginning part of it. Underneath, you see there's lots of storage space. And to begin with, this is the silverware drawer. And the silverware drawer is neat because I have forks, knives, spoons. I keep some games back here, some batches and stuff like this, uh, bottle openers, other different things. And this also doubles as a place to dry all your silverware and your plates when you get done uh, washing them at the end of the night. So I slide this in and out, and there's a nice place you can open it and pull it. Then I have some trash bags over here. I have another coffee cup. I have three coffee cups in this thing, just in case I, I'm making have some other people over. A, um, a brush to clean up some dishes, my box of uh, strike matches. I love these things, just love the rattle of it. Then in here, this is the cool part, because I pull this out and this is actually my dish sink. And inside here, this is my where I wash my dishes and it's big enough it holds everything and then I can just dry them separately. But I also have my pots and pans. My pots and pans, two, two pans, or, or lids also for the pots, then I have two separate pots. So I have all, I can do all sorts of different things. I can make pasta, I can make uh, bacon and eggs, I can make sausage, I can make French toast, all in these, this little set right here. And it's really nice, it, it's uh, very compact, easy to deal with, and even comes with a little mesh bag to keep everything organized and nice and clean. The other thing is that this mesh bag is good for is it allows you to put it back in there and then it just can do some air drying. The other things I have in here, which are kind of neat, I have plates. Now I carry some paper plates just in case I just want to do that and have a quick meal, I don't want to do a lot of dishes, or I have the metal plates. Uh, the metal plates, what I really like about these, and I've seen this some other, somebody else use this before, is that they'll make their meal and they'll use this as a lid. Uh, on the boiling water or, or the frying pan and that way this actually gets a little hot 
and you can then you put your meal on top of it and you have a hot plate and the food actually stays hotter a little longer. That's a cool tip. I have some cutting boards underneath here, three or four cutting boards just to, in case I, I need to cut up some vegetables or, or anything else that I need to do. And as you can see, this fits really nice back. Then I have two drawers alongside here. I keep some foil in there, keep some tongs, some Ziploc bags. You always need Ziploc bags when you're camping. Just some other paraphernalia that are in there. The other one, I have my lighters, my spatula, my spoons, my measuring cups, things like that. Once again, there's nothing better than knowing where this stuff is and it's out of the way so when you're cooking, you don't have any problem with it. Down below here, I have a little Tupperware bin. I have a couple coffee cups, some salt and pepper shakers. These are my clips from my um, tablecloth. I have some rope in case I need it, my dish sponge, some starters. Also clips to hold it. The, um, Tape cloth on it. And then on the end, end it, it has just a another place where I keep some bowls and some other things. Just nice all the way, nice and organized, nice and clean. I don't have to worry about grabbing things out of a big Tupperware box trying to figure out and make sure that if they're there, they're not there. So as you can see, this is a kind of a all-inclusive kit, very easy to pack into a truck, into the back of a, a car, get going for the weekend. It closes up very, very nice. has a little holder there. Coleman stove goes back on top of it. And, and you can even use just the, the, this as your cooking surface. Everything fits back inside of it really nice. So hopefully you, uh, if you get a chance to get one of these online, I strongly urge you to get one. I've seen them for about $100. Well worth it if you do as much camping as I do. Once again, this is the Cast Iron Kid, signing off. Hope you have a great time in the outdoors.